I'm here at Dobert booth at Automatica 2025 to show you the biggest launch they're gonna have here. Welcome, this is the new CR30H from Dobot Robotics, equipped with an integrated force torque sensor in one version. The other version is the standard version. Without force torque sensor, the first version is available with an NSF certification. What applications or industries you can see this cobot? This robot will mainly be used for end-of-line packaging applications like palletizing, case packaging, but also for machine tendling. In standard, we have IP67 for that series, but we have also a series which goes up to 25 kg with IP68, where you could literally dive into a swimming pool. And my favorite part about this one is the design. As you can see, there is really a smooth shape of the arm. And of course, the speed, that's around two meters per second or 300 degrees per second. And also I heard you have another launch here, a humanoid, is that true? Yeah, that's true, and I'm already looking forward to introducing the Dobot Atom, the first generation of our humanoids. Okay, let's go. The Dobot Atom is our first humanoid robot developed for additional tasks like in logistics and automation to have even more degrees of freedom and to be more flexible based on the capability to walk in the production facility. It's a great addition to our portfolio of industrial robots with extended safety features. Why Dobot decide to make a humanoid now? The reason why Dobot developed now humanoids is because we have already experience of a decay in terms of developing robotics, but we have also a great teammates in terms of how to push the intelligence. So now we combine the three core competences necessary to come up with a humanoid, which is vision technology, AI technology, and robotics in one single solution. And this is how Dobot is shaping the future of automation. Thank you.